can appreciate convenience and quality. For example, getting a bite to eat. A fast food burger with fries and a soda might curb your hunger, but how much nutrition did you really get from that meal? In order to find something to eat that is of better quality, we could all agree that it's going to take something more than a fast food meal. High quality food examples would look more like a balanced meal of fresh vegetables, lean meats, and whole grains. But that requires a bit more effort than the fast food option. Sometimes we have to weigh out the factors and choose. Do we want convenience or quality? So what if we change the example from food to information? Is convenience more important than accuracy? Using a search engine such as Google or Yahoo is a great example. Sure, you can throw out any question in a search engine and expect reasonable results. Like who won the game last night? Or what's the weather today? But when you need information that is related to historical facts or scientific findings, how do you know the search results are accurate? In this case, the search engine is choosing the fast food burger. It can be quick and fairly reliable, but what's the more nutritious example? Well, that, my friend, is called a database. A database holds more scholarly information, which is collected and often produced by researchers who are experts in their fields. Databases provide information that is safe, accurate, current, validated, copyrighted, and well-organized. Most people will access a database through their library. Libraries purchase databases so their patrons will have access to high-quality content for free. Databases are focused more on scholarly books and articles, much more so than search engines. Many databases contain academic journals, magazine articles, newspapers, and other sources, many of which have undergone peer review. That process helps us all know that the information is reliable and accurate. So, if you're looking for high quality information, remember to ask your librarian about their database of choice. It's the nutrition option for your brain.